going on guys grave here welcome back to destiny and today we're going to talk about a pretty awesome weapon that is available of course if you've been playing any iron banner and of course in case you guys do not know if you're some of my newer viewers i used to play a lot of destiny and used to upload a lot of destiny videos we get back into doing some destiny because i've been really enjoying it and now that pvp has kind of changed back to really to its original form when the game first came out i loved pvp everything was really balanced and there for a while it was more of everybody was just using pistols and it was kind of just bland to me. And, and, and now it's gotten back into, you know, everything's good, whether it be a scout rifle, a pistol, an AR, you know, or, or a pulse rifle or things like that. We're going to talk about the Hakon's Hatchet. Of course, this is a, a, a weapon that you can purchase it during Iron Banner or you can get it from a drop in game. I've probably gotten about seven of these in drop uh, for, you know, during drops in the game. Uh, I've had different perks on them from third eye to all kind of things. We'll talk about that here again in just a little bit. But this is the one that you can purchase. It is uh, definitely my favorite. We'll talk about some of the things you got. You can get on here. Of course, you have your different sight variations over here. You have range finder, which aiming with this weapon is increased. It, aiming this weapon increases its effective range. We have perfect balance to give some better recoil. We have a pended magazine, which uh, increases magazine size. Of course, we have reinforced barrel, which gives you better range and reduces stability. And of course, we have counter counterbalance, which this weapon has increased stability. I'll kind of let you guys see some gameplay of me using the weapon, and I'll kind of also talk about uh, the things I like about the gun uh, during the video. Like I said, guys, this is a really, really good auto rifle if you're a fan of auto rifles. And I have already ranked all three of my characters to rank five in Iron Banner. And like I said, I got tons and tons of drops of this weapon, but I never got any with this roll on it. I would say if you're not completely done, you're not to rank five yet, hold off on purchasing it if you have not if you have not purchased it yet. Just hold off. You may get it to drop with these perks on it, you know, with this kind of loadout that I I have here, you know, the ones you can purchase. I had some buddies that got this roll on their weapon course i just was not lucky enough to get it but of course you know it's always going to be kind of preference of what you like to use i did get some uh with third eye i got some with small bore there's a lot of good things out there but to me range finder and counterbalance perfect balance and reinforced barrel are really good together because you can either make it a pretty much spray and pray machine because it has a really high rate of fire and a lower impact and some good range and you, you can make it just a gun that just you know you can just Pour bullets out of it and it's taken really, really accurate. And of course, with that range finder, if you slap reinforced barrel on on a larger map, you can kind of just tap fire your weapon, and that works really, really well for long distance targets with an uh, with an AR. You have to be careful though. The weapon does have a lot of upward recoil, not a lot, but it does have some upward recoil if you do put the reinforced barrel on. But like I said, I just kind of swap it up with whatever I'm using for whatever map. And of course, on this map, the, the gameplay y'all guys are seeing is counterbalance and perfect balance together. And it's pretty much just a laser, and that's what I want a small map. Like I said, just hold off on purchasing it until I would say you get to rank 5 with your character or all your characters, or however many ever you have. If you have not got it in a drop by then, I guess go ahead and pick it up. You'll have enough legendary marks. That's what I did. I've kept some of my other ones also. That's some things on it that I also like. This right here is definitely my favorite one. This is definitely one I recommend uh, getting. It's a very consistent, very good weapon. Um, it, you can do a lot of things with it like i said close range and medium to longer ranges and i it's, it's a weapon that i can get consistent kills of anywhere from 20 to 30 a lot of games so it's definitely a consistent ar and if you are a fan of ars back in the day when destiny first came out if you're an old school destiny fan like i am you've played it for a long time you know you played it since the game came out this will remind you a lot of those ars that you know kind of the the good weapons back when the game first came out and you know ars were the big thing everybody used this is a very good weapon, guys. Leave me a comment and let me know if you have picked up the Hakon's Hatchet yet. And, of course, leave me a comment and let me know what you think about it. Let me know the perks and the rolls you have on your weapon. And, of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.